I'm Dr. Michael Atkins. I'm a medical oncologist and a specialist in the treatment of melanoma, and I'm deputy director of the Georgetown Lombardi Comprehensive Cancer Center. And I was also the chair of the DreamSeq trial, a trial that compared um, Nevo Ipi followed by Dubrafenib Trametinib to the converse sequence in patients with treatment naive metastatic BRAF mutant melanoma. And what the DreamSeq trial showed as its major endpoint is that the sequence beginning with immunotherapy first showed a 20% improvement in landmark two-year overall survival uh, relative to the sequence that began with Dubrafenib Trametinib first. Those absolute numbers were 72% of patients alive if they initiated therapy with immunotherapy compared to 52% of patients who were alive if they began with targeted therapy. Furthermore, the responses appeared to be more durable on immune therapy than targeted therapy, and the toxicity between the two frontline therapies were not different in terms of degree of severe toxicities. And so based on these results, we feel that for patients with BRAF mutant metastatic melanoma, a disease um, that is driven by a activated, activating mutation and for which there's a specific uh, targeted therapy for, that even in this case, immunotherapy should be the preferred initial treatment for the vast majority of